So all of the, all, everything you just said, how can you make that connection when you're trying to explain to somebody that, because, you know, they might not have read the Bible or even know about it, but make the claim of it's the white man's religion. <laughs> to make the claim that it's the white man's religion doesn't, it doesn't make sense in the, Geographically. yeah, and just in a sense of history, right? Like, um, we know that the apostles and the disciples, they weren't white. Um, Paul wasn't white. Um, <laughs> I'm sure not and, yeah, yeah, and they're, they're not American, but these are, are Middle Eastern Hebrews that are mistaken for, like Paul was mistaken for an African. Right. And like these are the people who are starting the church. Mm -hmm. And because of the glory of the death and the resurrection of Jesus Christ, a lot of people come to accept it. So therefore it it spreads. And then over a period of time, then things start to get misused, not just by, let's say, like slave owners, but by the Catholic Church as well. Like sometimes Religion does get misused, but the truth of Christianity goes back to Jesus, his death and his resurrection. And you can read about the truth of Christianity in the Bible uh, and in the New Testament. So for you to call it the white man's religion doesn't even it doesn't make sense.